guys welcome back to a new video i've not vlogged in about three weeks now something mad i hope you've been enjoying the uni videos but i thought today i'd just do a good old vlog um i'm gonna do got a lot of things i need to do i'm gonna sort out my room because it's just getting a bit of a shit tip and um go through like really old products and see what i need to use up and stuff and then i'm gonna go on a little walk and get a coffee and stuff like that so yeah i hope you enjoy this little homely kind of cozy sunday vlog i just love how it's like feeling a bit autumnal now and just everything feels cozy so i'm ready um i'm gonna make lunch to begin with it's about half 12 now and i'm really hungry so i'm gonna make lunch and then i'm gonna get on with the day also when i woke up this morning my skin looked horrible but just done like a skincare routine, put on some of that Kiehl's Glow stuff and feels so much better. My skin has been very hormonal recently and um, really not doing bits. So, actually enjoying having glowy skin for once in the last few weeks. Right, I'm going to make lunch and I'll speak to you in a little bit. So, sneak peek, this is my grad dress, my graduation dress. I've not yet tried it on. I need to, but I'm kind of like putting it off because I can't be asked it being wrong. But yeah, sneak peek of what you will see in the vlog. On the Instagrams. <laughs> So my garlic mushrooms on a toast. This is really nice sourdough bread, and then I've got some um, Covent Garden soup that I'm going to have with it as well. I want a nice little homely, cozy lunch. So this is going to be delicious. I've not had garlic mushrooms on toast in so long, so very excited. <laughs> Um, so mushrooms on toast, then another slice just plain because I like to dip that in my soup, you know the drill. Um, it looks delicious and got some other garden soup, so I'm going to scrum this and then be productive. <laughs> also guys, this um, company called Hydrate, Hydrate, yep, has sent me this really cool little bottle. I really wanted one of these for so long, so they um, reached out to me and said which one do you want? And I could choose some different styles, so I decided to get this one, you can't really see in this light. But it's like this really cute pinky colour and it keeps stuff hot and it keeps stuff cold as well so it's ideal for winter and summer. So yeah, I just thought I'd show you this because I know this is kind of like a growing trend with trend not to use plastic bottles and all of that. So definitely go and check them out. I love this bottle, it's the cutest colour and it matches my slippers. <laughs> Tuesday and I'm dressed kind of smart because I've got an interview today um I'm not going to go into like any details of the interview or what it's for just because I won't get it probably because there's just no when it comes to interviews I just find that there's no point even thinking that you're going to get it because otherwise you're just going to be disappointed and I'm going to get a lot of no's until I get a yes I've realized so um yeah but I'm going to Manchester for this interview so I thought I'd just bring you guys along you know keep it real um a lot of people don't even tell people when they have an interview, but I just thought, like, if I don't get it, who cares? I'd rather, like, keep you guys updated and so you can, like, know what it's like being a postgrad and trying to find a job because it's literally not the one. So last night I woke up in the middle of the night with, like, a weird tummy. I just felt a bit strange. And I had, like, a really, like, weird 10 minutes. It was actually a bit horrible. I thought I was going to have to go to hospital. Um, I, like, was kind of, like, feeling sick and weird and I was, like, lay on the bathroom floor and I couldn't really move, like I couldn't get up and I felt like I was really concentrating to be, to stay conscious. Um, and it was really strange and like everything was like whirling around me and my ears were ringing. I just didn't know what was going on and I don't feel very good today either. So yeah, that's how I'm feeling. I'm trying to kind of like ignore my hair. My head just feels a little bit weird and stuff. So I'm just trying to kind of ignore my head and just <laughs> power on through the interview. Um, I've had some toast this morning, um, which hopefully kind of made my stomach settle a little bit. Um, 
but I'll show you what I'm wearing and then I'm gonna go catch the train to Manny so yeah don't know if I'll actually go into Manchester because the interview is kind of like a bit out of Manchester um but I don't know I think maybe just to pop into natural central Manchester and do a bit of shopping or something but I don't know probably see how tired I am and what I'm feeling because I'm quite tired at the moment I've just been kind of like working at my um cafe part-time job and the hours there are so long and it's a really 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 intense job so I ended up getting really tired after that so it's always nice to have a few days off um but this week is pretty hectic because um I have got graduation tomorrow and got a few more things this week and then I'm working again um so this week's quite a busy one so I thought I'd vlog obviously gonna vlog graduation tomorrow I hope you're all excited to see that vlog because I am excited now I just kind of feel like I've been waiting so long to graduate when everyone else has been graduating all through summer um all of my friends have graduated and I feel like I've been waiting so long to graduate so I'm finally happy it's kind of like here and I just kind of want to get, get it done with but we're going to go for a nice family meal and stuff um, and it's just going to be amazing because it's in Lincoln Cathedral as well so it's going to be beautiful so I'm just going to go pack my laptop, pack my bag up and then I'm going to leave for the train this is the outfit, I have got on this um, Topshop coat which I don't actually wear a lot just day to day but I just tend to keep it for um, interviews kind of really smart things so I've not got rid of it because it just really works really well for interviews so I've also got a little black polo neck some jeans which I know is probably controversial for an interview um I think it's better to kind of dress in something you feel confident in and something that is you rather than a really like over the top kind of interview outfit and I think I do look if you can see in full I think I do look smart so that's the main thing so I've got on jeans and then these um heeled boots with my black bag as well so how do you think I look smart I hope I give off like the business attire <laughs> the business attire I hope I give off like the business vibe so yeah we're ready to go I might actually walk in trainers though and just pop these shoes in my bag because you know what I hate traveling with like uncomfortable shoes especially when they are um especially when they are heeled boots it just it just really aggs me. So I might take trainers. Yeah! Yeah! Back in the car shot with mother. Hello! Hello! <laughs> Mother has just picked me up from the station. The interview, I, I, I didn't really speak in Manchester, but it was just kind of like a really flying visit. And then I spent like 45 minutes with um, the interviewee and stuff. Like um, I actually like kind of know the interviewer. I don't go into details because it's not very professional, but so that made it a lot more relaxed, which was nice. Um, and she was lovely and it went really well. I'm not expecting to get it because I know she's also interviewing media graduates which would be a lot more suited to the role but we still got experience and we will see what the outcome is she says she's gonna let me know in the next week or so so me and mum just popped into waitrose because i've been looking for chocolate milk in so many shops like our chocolate milk and finally <laughs> we found it it's literally my child it's so good in porridge like it literally takes porridge makes porridge taste amazing and it's porridge season now so i'm very exciting but now we are going to this little pizza place because my boyfriend's coming around tonight so we are gonna get also we're gonna get um so the lighting's really bad we're gonna get takeaway pizzas together um mum's treating us be a nice little lady mm -hmm. so we're gonna go pick up those now before he arrives because we've not tried this pizza place yet and it's just down the road from ours and it looks delicious so very excited and if you know me you'll know that goat's cheese is my favorite pizza topping and they do goat's cheese topping which i'm so excited for so i'm gonna go get pizzas now and i will show you guys when we get them because they look delicious just got in with the pizzas delicious I also got some coleslaw because I don't know if you've ever tried this but coleslaw with pizza is literally like game changing it's delicious so cannot wait to eat these when my boyfriend gets here hey look pang on it what are you doing? I'm vlogging it just whipping up a oh that should not be on um what do you call it 
egg fried sandwich. I need to get the actual eggs out. I'm going to end this vlog this morning and start a new one today for graduation. Very excited. Um, we're just getting some breakfast. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed this little week in my life type of video um, and I hope you enjoyed today's graduation vlog I am excited now not really nervous I'm kind of just like so ready to get it done with now so um, yeah thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe down below and I love you all loads Mwah.